Surprise, surprise, surprise. <laughs> hey, royal family. Guess what, you guys? I am able to sneak a video in. Of course, I really don't have any kitchen equipment. I think I got this uh, bowl here, maybe a knife, uh, plate, saucer. So what we're going to do, this is going to be our appetizer for our holiday menu. We're going to do buffalo chicken pinwheels. Oh my guys, oh my guys, oh my God. It is so easy, but guess what? You know Miss O just ain't gonna leave it at pinwheels, right? We're gonna bake these babies. Yeah, we're gonna put them in the oven. All right, you guys, let's get started. Here I have uh, Mission Homestyle Tortillas. And you want uh, the large ones? Honestly, you got, oh, 22.5 ounce, all right? So these are the Homestyle Flour Tortillas. Of course, we're going to need green onions. Also, I have a rotisserie chicken breast that I just diced up, it's already seasoned, yum. Of course, we're going to use Frank's hot sauce. We're going to use sour cream, and we're going to use cream cheese. You guys, I really do prefer Philadelphia, but this is all I had, so we're just gonna jazz it up a little. All right, you guys, let me get the green onions cut up. Um, and also make sure your cream cheese is softened. And I don't have a tripod, so I'm going to have to kind of do this in segments because that's also been moved. You know, go figure. All right, you guys, let's get this thing cranking, and it won't take long. But I did get a video in. All right, I'll be right back. All right, you guys, here is the uh, flour tortilla. And let me show you what I did. Uh, that is one eight ounce of cream cheese. That is one tablespoon of sour cream and four green onions chopped up. Okay, here in this bowl, I have, uh, I said one chicken, seasoned chicken breast, but I think it's one and a half. And I added one third cup of Frank's hot sauce. And dang, it's pretty spicy, but you know, I'm not really a spice person, but still I wanted to give you options. All right, so what I'm going to do now is spread the cream cheese on this flour tortilla. Then I'm going to add some of the uh, buffalo chicken and I'll come back and show you guys once I have it on. Again, you guys, I don't have my tripod, so I can't um, sit the uh, phone on it and show you guys how I'm going to roll it but I'll let you see what I put on it. All right. Okay, this is how I uh, put it on the uh, flour tortilla. That is the cream cheese with the green onions. And here is the buffalo chicken. And I want you to notice that I left a little on the side dry because I'm going to roll it from that side. And you don't want your meat in the middle. You want it close to the edge. So when you get ready to uh, uh, fold it, you would just tuck it in. But I'll come back and show you guys uh, once I've uh, rolled it up. Okay, I've rolled it up. And the cream cheese on the end actually acts like glue. That way your tortilla uh, will stay folded. I'm going to do another one. And then I want to put it in the refrigerator for about five minutes. And then we'll cut it and put it on a sheet pan. So preheat your oven to 365 degrees because what we're going to do once I cut it, we're going to put it on the baking sheet and we're going to toast one side for five minutes. Then we're going to flip the other side over and toast it for another five minutes. All right, we're chugging right along. All right, you guys, I've sliced them up and it really do help if you uh, put it in the refrigerator for five minutes. I mean, I had the dullest knife and I was really trying to keep them intact. But I didn't tell you, go ahead and um, put butter on your baking sheet. Not a lot, um, just a little, 
because I definitely don't want these to stick. But remember, 365, five minutes, then flip them over for an additional five minutes. And if it's any shorter, I will come back and tell you guys. Now let's get ready and make a sauce for these. All right, in the oven they go. Okay, you guys, here is the finished product of the baked buffalo chicken pinwheels. And you guys, uh, once I baked them, the heat kind of, um, do I want to say it didn't intensify the heat, it kind of mellowed it down. And I just took a ramekin and put some sour cream in it so you can dip. Um, but this has to be on your holiday table, especially if you're serving wine or some type of mixed drinks. This is really, really good. All right, let me show you how I would eat it. I just take it, I'm going to dip it. You see that? Let me focus that. And just dip it in the sour cream. You see the buffalo chicken? Okay, here I go. Oh, wow. That is really good, you guys, with the sour cream. And the tortilla is not as doughy because it's been baked. But anyway, you guys, thank you for watching. Please share and subscribe. Thank you, thank you, thank you to all of my new subscribers and my old returning subscribers. I will be back. We're going to do a side and maybe a kike dessert. All right, you guys, stay blessed. Until I see you again.